Sony confirms that the new PlayStation will support 4K gaming. WhatsApp now allows you to quote and reply to a particular message. Intel to provide modem chipset for the Apple iPhone 7 and much more on today's daily. This is day 163 of 2016 and you're watching Phone Arena Daily, your everyday fix of technology news. Sony confirmed that the next generation of the PlayStation 4 console, which is basically an updated version of the current PS4, will feature 4K gaming support thanks to the improved graphics and updated processor. The new PlayStation will apparently be called the PlayStation 4 Neo and will be priced at a higher price point than the current PlayStation 4. It will not be unveiled at E3 conference that is scheduled to take place next week, as previous rumors have indicated, but the PlayStation 4 Neo will include backward compatibility for PS4 games and a new set of games are expected to feature the high-end support for 4K gaming as well. WhatsApp has released a new beta version for Android devices that supports quote and reply feature. This feature has been a basic feature for many other messaging or chat applications, but has been introduced on WhatsApp for the first time. So users can basically select the message that they wish to reply to and it'll be quoted in the reply as well. And this helps to clear misunderstanding as to which message you're actually replying to. This feature is currently available to WhatsApp beta testers through the Google Play Store. However, users who do not subscribe to the WhatsApp beta test can't actually use this feature. And even if you actually send them a quoted reply, you, they won't be able to receive it. Following the launch of the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1080 in India, they have also launched the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1070. The Zotac NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1070 Founders Edition is available at a price of Rs 40,800 which is its MRP and is available through retailers such as Amazon and other offline and online retailers as well. Last year, we heard reports suggesting that Intel has over 1000 engineers working on the Intel 7360 LTE modem chipset for the Apple iPhone 7. A new report from Bloomberg suggests that Intel have actually won their first order for the Apple iPhone 7. Qualcomm has been the sole provider for modem chipsets for the iPhone. However, new reports suggest that Apple will only be using Qualcomm for the GSM variants of the Apple iPhone 7 and that they will use Intel for the other variants. So today's deal of the day is basically an offer on the Stronshim 32GB microSD card that will give you the device at a price of Rs 509 compared to the retail price of Rs 9999. This microSD card can be redeemed at the link in the description below exclusively through Amazon. That brings us to a point of today's discussion. What do you guys think about the upcoming PlayStation 4 Neo? And would you think that it's a suitable upgrade to the PlayStation 4? And if you already own a PlayStation 4, do you think that you will be upgrading to the PlayStation 4 Neo? Do let us know in the comment section below and see you again tomorrow with more technological news.